Nothing is more awkward than being on a date and either running out of things to say or sticking to the same old boring questions. So what do you do? Where are you from? What do you do for fun? In this video, I wanna give you some amazing dating icebreakers that you can use to actually stimulate good conversation and mostly get to know your date. A lot of questions were, are so socially scripted. We have the same answers we give over and over again. That you're not actually getting to know someone. These questions are designed to actually get to the heart of their personality, to really get to know them, to see if they're the right match for you and if you're the right match for them. So here we go. One, do you have a bucket list and have you completed anything from it? I love this question because you're gonna see, are they up for adventure? Are they doing big things? Do things in your bucket list align? Have they completed anything? You'll learn a lot about someone from this question. Two, what family member are you closest to? If family is really important to you, I recommend asking this question. Don't ask, is family important to you? Because almost everyone will say yes. By asking who they're closest to, you're gonna get a better insight into how they really feel about their family. Three, what's the thing you're most excited about buying this year? This is kind of a tricky, interesting question because it gets them showing you about what's on their goal list without asking specifically about goals. And you'll also get to know, do they have big aspirations? or small aspirations. Four, if you had to delete all but three apps, which ones would you keep? This is great to see where are they spending most of their time, on social, on news, reading, working. Five, what would be your dream job if money didn't matter? Six, what was the first movie you saw in a theater? Seven, do you have any dishes that you're good at cooking? By the way, make sure you have a good answer to this question. Have a dish you are amazing at cooking because then maybe you can cook it for them. Eight, did you ever play a musical instrument or sing in a choir? Nine, what was the first concert you ever went to? 10, if you could change your work week, how would you change it? 11, do you prefer planning out your weekend or being spontaneous? This question is so much better than what do you do on the weekends or are you spontaneous? This gives you a little insight into would you have the same ideal weekend? 12, if you hosted a podcast, what would it be about? This is a great one because it gives you insight into what they like to talk about, what they like to think about, what they like to explore. Is it the same as you? 13, what career did you think you would have as an adult? In other words, when you were little, what did you wanna be when you grew up? 14, what's your favorite holiday? 15, what's your craziest travel story? 16, what's something you absolutely love doing? That's a nicer take on what's your hobbies or what do you do for fun. It digs at what's something they're really passionate about. 17, what's your favorite band or artist? 18, what's something you wish people knew about you? 19, which parents are you more like? 20, what's your favorite type of food? You can see with these questions, they're not too deep, but they're getting to more personality types. You're getting to know them a little bit better. Make sure you have great answers for these questions too. Be brave, ask non-social script questions, and tell me how they go. Put your favorite dating question or dating icebreaker in the comments. I would love to make a new video. Want even more icebreakers? Check out scienceofpeople.com slash icebreaker, or get our free conversation starter app. It's Conversation HQ, where we have thousands of conversation starters broken up by category from meetings to dating to kids to teens to grab bag. You can favorite the ones you like the best and also even submit your own. It's totally free. Grab it. It's Conversation HQ.